And now the start with Hamad Wasim, no surprise. He did it yesterday and is uh, renowned for it in T20. Wide. Not a great delivery. They're off the mark, Bangladesh. First one of the wood. And uh, Tamim is underway with a couple. Oh, that is a bit of zip. Here's a nick. Outside edge. First one down early. Celebration time for the league. And he's uh, come at it first drop. Two slips down. Good carry. I like it. Wicket with the new ball. Second delivery with the angle. Nipped back. And then after pitching, held his line. That's what you call seam. Beautifully bowled. Anybody could have nicked that delivery. Big edge too. Yeah, just, just closing the face a fraction, just enough. And only had to move just enough. And you only hit the dance. And it's a lovely length. It's a beauty. There you go. Wasi Makram right on cue. He's fatted this one as Mahedi Hassan. First maximum in match number two here. What a brilliant shot. A slightly fuller delivery. And the middle leg. Last little trouble, he middled it to perfection. Look at that, it was a big 82 meters. Huge hit. It's a big, big ground here in Lahore. Oh yeah, don't want to get in there. And it is a super quick outfield here at Gaddafi. Another boundary, this time to Min. Runs on the oval already. What a great delivery again. Middle leg to the left hander. You don't have a fielder at uh, square leg behind umpire for sweep. So he asked him for trouble. He's an experienced player, experienced bowler, Imad Basim. Single. And he tries to uh, see how much bounce is in the pitch. Is it uh, Asan out there, Asan Ali? Yeah, similar to uh, yesterday, actually. We tried to feel one there and couldn't. Oh, he decides to go short, straight up. Right up the chimney, real easy one here for Rizwan. Second one down straight away. Okay. Let's have a look. Banged it in, banged it short, and going away from Mehdi. And obviously, did middle in top edge, easy catch, Rizwan. And uh, Asnan is excited, he's got his first wicket, an important one too. In from batsman departs uh, for nine, Mehdi Asan, and the Bangladesh 22 for two now. Out in the middle, he, uh, well, he got to a dozen. Couldn't convert and go on. So unfortunate. Yeah, he was run out. One of the run outs at the top. He had to hit a couple of boundaries, basically, and got out. Slip in place now, and rightly so. Fine leg up in the circle. Just look how quick it gets down there to third man. This is a wicket of Mary. And that's the right height as well outside off stump and just the just above shoulder height and that's where the batsman will have a go most of the time he'll get the top edge that was quick delivery no fielder there the ball will race away to the boundary you got teams sliding on but uh, of course with the left hander Tamim on strike line too straight and off target good stuff We've got a single, but the fielding has been good here yesterday, and it's still a good standard. We've had five. Ah, oh, beautifully timed. What a good shot that is. Used the pace extremely well. Take this right till the end for Bangladesh. Have a look at the timing, the sliced angle of the blade doing the job, and balance was good. Balance on the front foot in slicing the ball past that point fielder.
got to do this regularly. Rotating the strike is the key to build pressure and momentum. Shot beautifully played. Left-hander's elegance is personified. Side a little. He's bending low, hit him on the flap of the pad. No inside edge, so he hit the pad, and ball tracking really will confirm the fact that it pitched, pitched within, would have gone on to hit part of the leg stump, so it will stay as a pass call. Marginal, but give it. Sticks with the umpire's call, uh, very, very marginal like we saw. There you see the signal on screen as well. Pakistan making inroads into the top order here. It was completed, 41 for the loss of three. First ball of the over is a dot from Shadab. Let's go down to Danny Morrison. England nowadays, so it's possible, you know, but strange to see it here in Pakistan. It has been, uh, it's been quite good so far. How often have you been to this part of the world? Uh, this is my... Uh... Go back upstairs because I think we've got a little run-out call, have we? but still will get a green light. Over to you, Danny. Oh, OG got to go here. I think it's gone all the way, has it? We've had the 50 come up previously. Here's a maximum. Gentlemen. Middle of the bat. Beats him all ends up. Keeper is excited. Shadab says, out or not out? This time he goes down the wicket. And he connects well. And it's been taken, it's been taken outside the ground. That's a maximum from the bat of the effort by this youngster. The ball boy. Call is for two. They're going to settle for one here, maybe two now. They're coming round the wicket. He cuts that angle. He's trying to flick it away. It's off. Oh, that must have slipped out of the hand. It has to be a no ball. And it is, uh, looks like it's going to be a free hit also above the waistline. Yep. What? Short ball. Uh, he's not uh, put that away. He's got away with that. Only a single. Not a bad one off a free hit for Pakistan. Shy at the stumps direct hit. I, I reckon he's okay. Yeah, he's absolutely fine. He's absolutely fine. Get on with the game. Big appeal, he went across. It's all happening here. Oh, good effort by Mark Rasim backing it up. He's given the out. He looked close. He looked out to me as well. Involved as well. Yeah, I reckon it's hitting uh, probably very close to the off stump. Well, uh, certainly no question of height here. Initially, to the naked eye, I thought it might have hit him right above the rolls. Out to the leg stump. There you go. Review retained. That's a good review taken uh, from Tamim. That was uh, perhaps the only other option in favor of the batsman. Had it pitched outside the leg stump. Yep. He needs to reverse it. He bats on. Pick is outside edge. Straight into the hands. Gone. He's got his second wicket. Good over so far. And Shadab is into it again. And it's a boundary. Perfect timing versus Shabnam Chowdhury. In the career. Well, it's evident that he's trying to get a move on. Well, it uh, might be a freebie because it is above the waist side. We'll just have a look at Aston Raz. It just wants to check this. Short. And has been uh, pulled away, but and it's going to go to the boundary. So, oh. 
Oh, what happened there? Lost it. Going full again. And unfortunately for the bowler, it's gone for four. Yeah, can't bowl there. Seen this happen in the uh, Bangladesh Premier League on a few occasions. Really poor piece of running from a very experienced man. Yeah, this is the... And that is out. Yeah. He's gone for it, gets an inside part of the bat, and it slithers away for a very, very... Last ball. Uh, flashing blade, nice. Really nice way to finish things. A boundary, the last ball of the innings allows Bangladesh to get to 136 for six here. What the Pakistani bowlers have done. The Bangladesh, they'll be a little frustrated and disappointed. They could only muster 136 for six. Stand out there, Tamim Iqbal with that half century. Nothing else much to write home about. And in contrast, the bowlers, seven of them used, and uh, it's the usual suspect. Hassan Ali. Captain will be pleased about that because uh, he got out for a duck here yesterday. And he's underway straight away. Oh, that's very friendly to say, look, I like you, Baba. Oh, hello. She said as crisp for no run. Oh, and he's gone ambitious. Mumadullah. Should be and is. Very. And he goes to zero. Nice bit of footwork from the old boy. And Hafiz. And it please him. Take a... Oh, it's in the air for some time. But he's timed it well enough as the professor. Here's another boundary. Showing my age. And showing some class here is Baba Raza. He says, Hafiz, I'm... More wrist work and more runs. All good hustle from those old legs. Starts uh, with a ball down the leg side. You always feel that when a new baller comes in, he's got to be spot on, on target. Nothing loose. Again, a looseness to start with. Straight to the boundary. No need to run for those. He's on fire. The Mehdi Hassan, right arm off spinner. Back in the attack. He'll be finishing off his full goal of four overs. 3.1, none for 23 now. Again on a shorter side. Not been very good with the, the ball, have they? He doesn't turn the ball at all. He bowls so quick, and of course, a 50 partnership up. Going on to the pad, he's slapped it away for a single. He's not very special so far in this uh, game, and I think but the way they batted, they looked off color today, Bangladesh side. They played much better yesterday. In two matches. That's so frustrating, I can imagine, for uh, Bangladesh. Uh, uh, you know, the, the, the think tank, of course, the team as well. You made. Nicely played with the spin, another single. Four up. That's a poor delivery to finish the over. Short, wide, gets the treatment. One bounce over to the pen. That's beautifully timed, really well timed by Hafiz. That's good enough edge, earns him a four, Hafiz, into the 40s as well. Uh, it's up edge, but it's uh, safe and it's struck pretty well too. Taps it for a run, gets to 50 Hafiz. He's been a lot more fluent in this knock compared to his last one. The dugout is happy. Such a good shot. Wrist work through the offside and timing there as well. Well feel in the deep. Two runs to Barbarazam. He makes look. 
Oh, that's a smash, gone. Six. Class for you, Barbara. Excellent shot. Guides it away for a run. The crowd will cheer. Another 50 from Barbarazam. 13th in it. He's a classic. He sure is. And uh, he's made the crowd here to get out of the stadium very happy. And that's gone up in the air. And has it gone all the way? Top aced it for a six. Has he? And, uh, Avif has been uh, thrashed down to a vacant third man. Wonderful wrist work. And there it is, the crowd let you know that it is all over here at Gaddafi. And the series has been won with one to play here from the home side. No problem whatsoever for this Pakistan side against the Bangladesh. Winning the series easily, two nil up. Comfortable win, 137 for one in 16 points. And Hafiz with the half century, 66 to the skipper and 67 to the old gun, Muhammad Hafiz. They got to the target of 137 for one and 16.4 overs. Bowling, they needed to get wickets up front. They couldn't. And really, that was the problem for the Bangladesh Tigers. The only successful bowler there, Shapahal Islam, one for 27. Man of the match was the skipper with his uh, lovely innings. Compiled there, 66 not out of 44, seven fours and one six was the standout of the second T20 International. 136 for six, never seemed like it was going to be enough. To him, the half century and the uh, wickets shared amongst the usual suspects. Pakistan, 137 for one and 16.4 overs. Hafiz and Babarazm doing the stuff for the home side, a win by nine wickets and the series 2-0 out of three. Until next time, we'll do it all again.